Ang programang ito ay rated SPG. Striktong patnubay at gabay ng magulang ang kailangan. Maaaring may masiselang tema, lengguahe, karahasan, sexual, horror o droga na hindi angkop sa mga bata. Hello everyone, thank you for tuning in to my channel. Salama, salama. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Today, we love thy woman. Dana's going crazy. She comes out of the uh, courthouse and she pulls out, our, she's gonna go home and uh, see Dave or see Michael after, you know, she finds out that uh, Gia is uh, the legal, you know, parent and they, they gave the child back to uh, G Gia since uh, the court papers show that she gave birth to Michael. So um, they're sitting in there and she's like, I'm going. She's mad at her dad because her dad, you know, he, he says sorry, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, sorry you lost, you know, but um, you know, you'll have to deal with it. So she turns around, you know, she reaches in her purse, she pulls out a gun, says she's going to kill Gia. Her dad's like, give me the gun, give me the gun. And she's like, no, pa. Uh, she's going all crazy. And then she uh, looks at Gia, says, you're dead, pulls the trigger. It doesn't go, it, it, it goes off, but there's no bullet. She pulls back again on the, on the gun, to, you know, like she's putting another bullet in there, pulls it again. And she's, she leaves, saying, I'm going home to see Michael. Ha ha, her dad's like, uh, Gia, you gotta understand, you know, uh, she's gone crazy. All she has in her life is Michael, and now you're gonna have the child back. You'll, you'll get your child back. So she's just crazy. So she goes home, and she tells the maid, you know, get Michael's all his clothes, put it in a suitcase, hurry up. We're going, we're going on a trip. So she's planning on getting the child and splitting. Um, so she's yelling at Michael, come downstairs, come downstairs, hurry up, we gotta go, we gotta go. And while she's saying that, the maid comes back in and says, Dana, your parents are here. So she sees her dad and mom pulling up, so she says, Michael, stay up there, stay up there, don't come down, go to the bedroom. So he goes to his bedroom, uh, Dana runs upstairs, she locks herself in the room, and then her dad goes upstairs and he's knocking on the door telling Dana, come on out, we need to talk. And she's like, no, I'm not coming out of the bedroom. Lucy comes out, tells her, open up the door. She's not gonna open up the door. Uh, so he calls for the maid to bring the key upstairs and unlock the door. Dana's like, how dare you? How dare you come into my bedroom? And Adam's like, how dare I? This is my house. I'll go wherever I want. Now, now come on out and let's talk. So she's outside and she's talking to her dad and he's like, I'm, I'm sorry, you know, Michael has to go back, but it's the right thing to do. And so I, I don't want to hear it. And she's like, I'm not going to give it. I'll kill. I'm going to kill Gia. And he's just like, don't say that. You, you're not, you kill Gia, I will. I will ban you. I will forget that you're my daughter. I've, you, you, you're through. I will have nothing to ever to do with you. You'll be vanished from my from my memory and everything. So she goes back in. Uh, Lucy's like, you know, Adam walks back downstairs. Lucy's like, no, oh, you better watch what you're saying to your dad, because your dad's not joking. When he says he'll do it, you know him. He will do it. She's all. So you need to start using, you got to start using your head and not your heart because you're just bitter and you're angry. You got to use your, your head and stay ahead of everything. She's like, well, I want my son. She's like, nothing's done. Don't ever give up hope. It's, it's never done. So you just got to use your head and plan something <coughs> and take advantage of it. So, David gives, uh, David calls, you know, he's talking to his mom, and he's like, I want to see my, you know, Michael, Michael's my son. 
and uh, David's mom's like, well, you know, just wait till tomorrow, uh, you know, uh, the, Michael will be over at Gia's house tomorrow in the morning, so he's all, I want to talk to Michael, so he calls over there, and Gia, you know, she picks up the phone, and she's like, you're, you're, you're correct, you know, we just need to come clean and, and tell Michael everything, how you, how you, you know, how Gia got in the middle of us, broke us up, and you guys, you know, had an affair, and Michael's like, no, or David's like, no, 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 don't do that, he's, he's, he's eight years old, he's, you know, it's not the right time to do this to him, and she's like, what, Michael's right in here in the bedroom, here, let's, let's tell him, and he's like, no, don't, don't do it, even though Michael's not in the room, just Lucy and, uh, Dana are talking about it, and then he's like, no, no, and then she hangs up, and she starts laughing, and Lucy starts laughing, it's like, good, now you're starting to use your head, so, Michael call or, uh, David calls Gia and tells her, you know, uh, what, what Dana's saying she's gonna tell, you know, Michael, uh, I just don't know why they just, you know, it's a movie, or show, I don't know why they just didn't call the judge and say, you know, if she wants to have anything to do, she can't act this way, or the judge will just say, you know, you're not allowed to see the child at all. So uh, you better change your attitude. Uh, so David, or Adams grabs Michael, got all his luggage, he takes over to, to Gia's house, and he's like, you know, this is, this house is too small. Let me buy you a big, bigger house for you, your mom, and uh, and uh, Michael. And Gia's like, no, we don't need a bigger house, Dad. This, 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 we're renting a house. This will do. And when she's talking, uh, the PI comes in, the one that's looking for Harry for uh, Kai. And uh, David or Adam meets him. And you can tell he's kind of like, oh, you know, like, well, who's this guy? You know, I think he's gotten a little get get jealous, but. Uh, Gia says, I'm going to go outside now and get Michael. So Adam goes out front. You don't see Michael at all. Um, next thing you see them, uh, the, the show for bringing Michael's clothes and luggage upstairs to his new bedroom at Gia's house. And, uh, you know, you don't see Michael, but what we're going to see tomorrow is Dana's going to be calling... She wants to play this out. She wants to talk to Michael and tell Michael, you know, um, you need, your dad will listen to you. Tell him that you want him to get back together with me and that's, and then you can come back and then we'll be in one big happy family. And uh, so she's trying to, you know, mess with the kid's head. So tune in tomorrow and we'll see what's going to happen. Uh, I know it's starting to get close. Hopefully, Harry will be coming back with the documents to throw Lucy in jail. And then uh, we'll go from there. Um, and you know, it's starting to get close to the end. Uh, I thank you all who all subscribed to me. Salam, Apo. I appreciate it. Uh, it's, it's, a, it's an amazing ride with all you guys. And uh, I hope I'll see you all tomorrow. And we'll go over the next episode. So, salamapo. Stay clean. Stay, you know, wash your hands. And uh, wear your mask. And uh, stay away from crowded people. Because uh, coronavirus does kill. Have a good night. Bye-bye. Salama. And uh, for anybody out there, uh, hopefully y'all shout out for my wife. Ro hey, Rosie John. She has her psoriasis really kicking in the arthritis so she's real sick it's it's not good um she needs to get her uh medication so all her joints feel better because it's you know it's her arthritis the psoriasis arthritis is bad and uh uh it's just hard to say you know i feel i feel for my wife and uh ooh, hopefully she'll get her medicine soon so she'll be back on Hey, Rosie John, and uh, tune in and see her as well. Bye-bye.